I don't know what happened. Got crushed or something. No, I emailed a two or three job postings, but nothing came from them. The one that did call me back was I googled them right away and they were actually and each year we harvest only the best of the best. Are you ready to move on? To take on new challenges? To become more than you ever dreamed you could be? Talk to your supervisor to see if you meet the requirements for this year's soul harvest. Right now I just wanna go to E3 and enjoy that. It's the same thing happened last year. I was looking for a job and then uh, decided to go to E3 for the first time and put it on hold for a bit and then came back totally ready. I don't know, the job I have now it's good sometimes and other times it's unbearable. It's hard to decide what I want to do. I'm gonna keep looking, just not have it be my whole day after work or whatever. I'll check the job boards, kind of like I check gaming. Check throughout the day here and there. Thinking about going and getting my real estate license. It's like a nine hundred dollars and some classes and stuff, but. Good job market and security limits required. I don't know, I've never really known what I want to do, so I'm already kinda of doing stuff like that. Why is this? I'm gonna shoot. Three is gonna be awesome. I'm hoping nothing more leaks when it comes to like what's gonna happen there. I don't wanna like last year, Xbox's whole briefing was like a shock. The Elite controller was kind of leaked way before that, but still nobody really knew. I totally forgot by that point. It was that backwards compatibility? Quite a few of those games. Really happy to be there for such a good briefing. Well, they've all been good ever since Matrix. Ron Matrix stopped running the show. That guy was an idiot. Access denied. Yellow security limits required. Remember back in 2009, Bungie, who sucks now, but back then they were awesome. And they, they did a big countdown on their website, all cryptic and stuff, and then right at the last, right at the last second, Don Matrick booted them from the briefing so that he could show more Connect stuff. And Bungie had to come out; they looked like idiots and delay their announcement of their game by. I don't even use backwards compatibility, and I, I'm glad they have it, but people just go crazy over games coming to it. Every time you look at Major's Twitter or Aaron's Twitter, especially Major's though, there are people are bringing up some old Call of Duty game being backwards compatible. Three sixties aren't that expensive and you probably already have one anyway, so that's not the new achievements. It's convenient but it's nothing to obsess with. People are getting all mad. Oh. Yeah, I can, 
I can't even keep up with all the new games. I'm, I want to go back and play Deus Ex uh, Human Revolution. Especially now that the director's cut is be uh, backwards compatible. I really want to play Mass Effect 2 again, but that's just because I want to. With Day of Sex, I have to play that because the new one's coming out. And I've never played the director's cut. I've had the director's cut for over a year now. Dead. music. What the heck was that? That's the way I came in. I have no idea what that is.
uh, my name on here, UNS Cleric, it's... The C stands for two different things. I used to always do that stuff when I was young. The UNS is from Halo, and then Cleric is from a movie called Equilibrium with uh, Christian Bale. It's one of his first kind of known movies. The movie is uh, Cleric. Clerics are like these badass like, uh, guys that know all these cool moves and stuff. It's hard to explain. It's like a dystopian type movie, and he works for the, the bad guys. And Welcome to the UNC's Mars installation, really good. located in the vast Hellas Plain impact basin. This high tech mining and research facility is pushing the boundaries of the imagination. It's called Equilibrium, though. As a valued employee, yeah, Claire John Press. It's more than yep. just a commitment to the UAC, it's a commitment to the future of mankind. Ooh, I like Thank you for your service. This game is really slick with the controls and all that. And then in October of 2014, I changed my gamer tag. First time in almost 10 years, uh, Reclaimer Rob. So I felt like the movie was kind of older, and I actually thought the UNSC was kind of turning bad at that point in the Halo universe, so this kind of started fresh. Ooh, this is a cool job. 